What's up YouTube? This is Kellen with Dream Media Home Theater. If you guys are not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button down below and give us a big thumbs up on the video. We really appreciate the support. Today, we're gonna be unboxing an ultra short throw screen from Screen Innovations. This is going to be more of a premium product, um, but if you guys already have an ultra short throw projector or if you're interested in buying one, this is going to be one of the best options for the screen that you're gonna need for an ultra short throw projector. And we're gonna get into why it's important to have a screen. So without further ado, stick around because we're gonna get right into it after the intro. All right, <laughs> let's get into it. Be careful using a knife with any screen to cut things open. You're not gonna damage anything by just Cutting these off, but something to note. All right, peeling back the cardboard here. It's important to inspect this product before you get too far into it, guys. If there's anything wrong with it, if you see damage on the box, if it's damaged during shipping, you need to reach out, let it take care of you right away. All right, guys, your first warning here. It says stop, follow all assembly instructions incorrect assembly can lead to damaged product or will void the si warranty ensure that black diamond material does not kink during handling as it could leave permanent marks keep sharp objects away from the screen material so we're not going to have to worry about the black diamond material this is the ultra short throw material take off the styrofoam ends on each side says do not use blades to open. Be very careful here to open up the box on the end. This is gonna have pretty much everything we need to put the screen frame together. As we can see the screen frame is tucked into this tube and it looks like the screen material is wrapped around that tube so it's not tightly wound like other things so inside the box just real quick you're going to have the si logo down at the bottom we have the corner brackets for the screen frame we have some some heavy plastic corners all the screws to put the frame together Looks like some more brackets, the wall brackets that hang it onto the wall. So everything that you need to put it together. And it looks like it also comes with some black gloves to put on whenever you're hanging the screen. So I'm gonna put this box right up here. And then I'm gonna roll this off the cardboard and kind of get things spread out and get ready for this thing to put together. All right, guys. Welcome back. This is the standard assembly. It's got four pieces, obviously. Both long pieces run parallel. That's gonna be the top and bottom of the screen. Then you have the shorter sides. That's gonna be the vertical pieces that run parallel to the left and right of the screen. This is kind of flipped over, uh, facing down. So if you were to hang this on the wall, you know, this is gonna be the frame, the back of the frame facing up to you. So this is how you're gonna to want to lay it out pre construction uh, open up the user's manual it'll follow along from there we're going to go pick out some parts that we need we're going to get the l brackets and start tying these corners together all right guys just laying out the pieces again you're going to have four l brackets and you're going to have four more so what you're going to do you might be able to show this up on camera so this one is a lot thinner than this one it's also a lot lighter so you're gonna need one of each for each corner. I'm just gonna go ahead and separate those out. All right guys, so the next part here, you're gonna to wanna to take the thicker bracket, that's gonna be the inside L bracket for the inside of this corner. You're gonna take the slimmer for the outside of the corner. And line them up the best you can.
and voila. Now you're gonna make sure each corner is perfect. You don't want one side a little longer than the other. So you wanna make sure that these are perfect. And then you'll turn these set screws. Just hand tighten them for now. But we're gonna continue that process to all four corners. All right, so now we've got the frame laying back face down on the screen material. So with the ultra short throw material and the black diamond material, you have to use these little plastic corners on the fabric. So we're gonna attach those and then Screen Innovations makes it super simple. On these screens, if you can look here, all these little beads just snap the material. So it makes it super, super, super simple attaching the screen material to the frame. So we're gonna take our time. We're gonna button up all of these. All right, now that we have all four corners perfectly aligned to the material, you're just gonna spread out those gray snaps all along the frame and it's gonna be pretty easy. I'll show you real quick how that looks. So you'll get these spread out down the frame. And then we'll have one right here. So just slide one into place. So you'll just slide one of these into place. You just pull it up till you hear the snap. It's a tedious process. So you're just gonna work yourself around the frame till they're all buttoned up and then they'll be ready to hang on the wall. All right guys, we are about 35 minutes into it. All the buttons are strapped around the edges. Now it's time to put on the bezel and we'll be able to hang it on the wall. All right guys, that's gonna wrap it up for today. We got the bezel all the way around the screen and I can say that this thing is premium. It is super nice. Uh, again, this is the Screen Innovations 100 inch Zero Edge Pro with the Ultra Short Throw screen material. It retails for about $4,600. If you guys are interested in this product or anything that you see on our channel, make sure you reach out and show your support. We have the lowest price guarantee and the nationwide free shipping. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Again, we're gonna be doing shootouts with the Vava, the Samsung, and the Epson LS500. We're gonna be going over all of the technology inside of them, what makes each one great, as well as comparing the screen materials, the screen that comes with Epson against the SI. So stay tuned, you're not gonna to wanna to miss that. Subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification so you're aware when every episode drops. This is Callum with Dream Media Home Theater. Thanks for watching.